Hey, what's going on? It's John Stewart here, Alamo City Cello. Uh, I've installed into this cello two pickups. One on the top plate, about here, and one on the bottom plate. And they terminate into a stereo jack that's been connected into the bottom of the cello. So this video is really about the placement of pickups. So the top plate initially, the reason I did it is I, I felt it was, it was a great sound for pizzicato, whereas the bottom plate took some of the edge off and it was better suited for arco for use of the bow. But then I found by blending the two together, you could create some very pleasing sounds. So let's give this a listen first with the natural sound of the cello uh, as picked up by a Octava uh, MK12 microphone, small diaphragm condenser. And this is with no amplification. <laughs> And now the same snippet with amplification. So it definitely affects the sound and adds to it. Um, the top plate uh, is a little bit more aggressive sounding and I think is well suited for rock or jazz or blues. Let's listen to just now only the top plate pickup, the top plate. The same, the same section now with the bottom play pickup. This is with bottom. It's definitely darker. It definitely has a darker sound. So how about the two of them together now blended about equal amounts, equal amounts. By blending the two together, you can get some really very interesting results. And to me, it sounds very 3D, like you hear, this, there's a sound inside of a sound. So um, an interesting and fruitful experiment. And so um, it's something I've been tinkering with for a few years. And uh, I think it's definitely, it definitely has possibilities. Most of this technology, I'm borrowing from guitar, uh, guitarist and acoustic guitarist in particular. And they've had a long sort of history with pickups and the need to amplify. So uh, we're taking the cello in places that it's never been before. And I think playing with instruments that it hasn't naturally been paired with, like bass and drums, uh, with a big band situation and uh, rock and roll venues. And uh, so we live in interesting times. Okay, thank you very much. You have a good day.